Racing Louisville FC is getting ready to kick off their 2022 season and joining me today to share some of the detail is Racing Lou FC's Gemma Bonner. Thank you so much for talking with me today. Oh, it's great to be with you. Okay, so the team recently hired a new coach. How has the dynamic changed with having a new head coach? Yeah, obviously, um, we've all come back the past couple of days. I think there's been a lot of changes, uh, both players and the staff, and it's been a real positive vibe throughout the place. Um, and everyone's come back and we're, we're wearing to kind of get on the training pitch. We had a day of testing, um, and now we're just trying to get the training philosophies out on the field and, and move forward and grow together as a team. That is so exciting. Okay, now obviously every team's goal for the season is to make it to the playoffs and win the NWSL championship. But can you talk a bit about some of the team's other goals for the season? Yeah, of course. I think making the playoffs is, is definitely an ambition of ours. Um, and ultimately, like you say, the NWSL championship. But I think for us, we're, we're such a new group together. We're still in the very early stages of even being a club. And I think for us, we've got to gel as quickly as possible with the new management coming in. And we've still got a lot of players um, that are coming fresh in this year and who are also very young as well. So. I think for us, it's about learning about each other and um, getting better individually and collectively every single day. And hopefully, I think we've got huge potential within our group. Um, so I think for us, our, our focus is to find the consistency and, and kind of reaching that potential as soon as we can. Absolutely. OK, now you're from England and you previously played for Manchester City. What's your experience been playing for an American League team? Yeah, it's, it's been an exciting challenge for me um, and I've really enjoyed it so far. I think every game it's an exciting one to play in. Um, I think, you know, the games seem to be a lot more end to end, a lot more transitional um, than back in England. But for me, it's like I say, it's a new challenge. Um, it's a new way of playing and you're coming again, up against the best players in the world every single week, um, no matter what team you're playing. and. I think the thing that excites me about the league is, you know, the teams could be at the top end or the bottom end of the table and you cannot predict the, the flow of the game or the result that it's going to be. So for me, it, it was an exciting challenge um, and it's one that I'm really looking forward to having a full season ahead this year. So I have to ask, have you gotten homesick at all? <laughs> um, you know, I thought I'd left the weather behind me, but <laughs> since I've come back, I feel like I'm at home anyway. Um, but no, you know, it, it's tough moving away from home. And I think last year it wasn't too bad because it wasn't for such a long period. Um, but the girls here, the whole club in general, they've, they've been unbelievable with me. And they really kind of make it feel like a family environment um, in and around the training facility. And, and you know, the people um, around Louisville, they've been really welcoming. Um, and, you know, the girls, the coaching staff, they've been great. So. For me, of course, I'm always going to miss home, um, but but I've really enjoyed my time here so far and I'm excited for, for what's to come this year. And that's nice too, because your team, yeah, becomes kind of like your family. So that's, that's comforting. <laughs> and so you've been in Louisville since June, is that right? Yeah, I came over first in June um, for the end of last season. And then I've had a couple of months back at home for Christmas, which was great to kind of get back and um, yeah, I've come back to these storms and the, the very warm weather. <laughs> yes, I thought abs I left. Yeah. yes, absolutely. Okay, it, quickly, what's your favorite part about Louisville? Do you have something, a place or any kind of thing that you've really kind of fallen in love with? Yeah, I mean, where we live, it's it's right on the, um, the kind of riverfront. So, you know, I, I've loved going out for walks down uh, along the river and over the walking bridge um, and into Indiana. So. For me, there's, there's some cool coffee shops, great places to go out to eat. Um, but yeah, it's, it's nice and it's quite a small town, but there's so much to do. And I'm really enjoying kind of exploring it and hoping to do a lot more of that this year too. That's awesome. Well, thank you so much for talking with me today. Oh, thank you very much. And Racing Lou FC will have 14 matches at their home field this season. For more information, just go to racingloufc.com.